Uh, one of the things that I've we've, I've been dealing with lately with buyers um, wanting specifically wanting to put in pools. Mm -hmm. How does that function with the septic? And maybe talk about kind of the rules as far as setbacks. Um, you know, can can people put a septic next to a pool? Does that how does that function? Well, the the state created a um, a, a, a test. So if you went to the town to get a permit for a septic. They would tell you, you have to do a B1. You have to go to the health department, get signed off. You have to do a B100 test, which is test holes. Test holes, yeah. Right. And that determines, um, you know, usually if you have a nice size property and your septic system is the current one that you have is working properly, uh, it, it's usually not a problem to fit in a pool. Mm -hmm. uh, it's when the area is constricted and the septic system that's there is really old. It's not working well. Mm -hmm. So now you're looking at, okay, well, now we need to go to a different area to put a septic in. Is that going to interfere with where you want to put the pool in? Right. And the town, regardless of what the homeowner wants to do, the town will actually tell you, no, you can't put in a pool because that's where the septic system is more important. Gotcha. And they would, they would stop you from putting in the pool or, you know, but, you know, if you want to spend enough money, you can figure it out. There, there are ways to figure it out and, and get a septic system in or a new one with a pool. 